super lock. The one feature that any facilitator worth their salt will forget about at least once. Maybe I can save you some of the embarrassment. Here's the use case. Now imagine you've set out this whole complex template, perhaps a little bit more complex than the template I have here. I just grabbed one of the frameworks from the library and uh, I've placed it here on, on this canvas. Now let's say someone comes in and they start working on it, adding content, adding details, misplaces a sticky note, wants to move it, grabs the wrong place and then moves the whole canvas away. This has happened to a lot of us in large sessions where people add content and then all of a sudden the content that you want to have stay in place, just moves off. This is where the feature of super locking or locking something in place comes in really handy. Now the way that you lock something down is really easy. You select the content that you want to lock, grab it. I'm just going to grab everything that's in the viewport. You right click on that element or what element you want to lock, go down and you'll see you have a feature lock. You can lock so that any member can unlock so this is a handy feature so if you want to lock something down and still make it available so someone else can come in that is a non-facilitator to unlock it you can do that but then you can also lock something down that only facilitators can unlock and to be honest i usually use this one most of the time so you've now locked everything down and indeed if i go and i want to go and grab and drag this nothing is can move because i've indeed locked everything down However, I also want to point something out. Now I have tried to select this area, nothing works. A nice tip here, you'll see that Mural actually reminds you if you want to unlock something or select it in your facilitator, there's a way that you can do that. I'm going to demonstrate that now. So if I hit Shift and Command, if you're in a Windows, it might be different, Shift and Control, and I, and I drag and select, you'll see that I am now able to actually select something. It becomes selectable. I've selected everything and I'm going to make it smaller. Just select the little sticky notes and you'll see that there's little locks next to the elements here. So I'm going to quickly point out that there's a little lock. So if I click on that, what will happen? I get a little drop down and it says unlock selection. So I can specifically only unlock the elements that I've now selected. So if I'm show you this, these are now again movable. I have unlocked them. Remember, it's only facilitators that can do this unless you've set it to be able to be unlocked by anybody. Once again, I just want to quickly show you how I've done that. So if I right click on the element, a little contextual menu will pop out. I have the lock um, feature over here, and then I have the ability to either lock it for any member to unlock or only facilitators can unlock. And if I activate that, that element becomes locked and I cannot move it. However, Mural will give you a little pointer. If you try and unlock it, it sits over here as a facilitator. And if you want to just select that little element, and this can be handy when you have a more complex template than this, shift, command, or shift and control, you select that area, you right click on that element, and then you'll have either unlock or unlock all. Just a quick point on unlock all. If you hit unlock all, it'll give you a warning, because it'll say it'll unlock all the elements. If you say unlock all, it will indeed unlock everything that is currently locked on your template. That's not something that you want to do all the time. So be careful that you don't unlock something that you don't want to have unlocked. However, I'm going to do that again, unlock, and I'm just going to say unlock that item. And then you'll see that I'm now able to move this around. So uh, definitely a super handy feature to, um, to go and explore, especially when you start laying out your own templates and canvases for your work session. So that is the super lock feature on the facilitation superpower side.